Alright guys, we are back with another pack opening. We have 12,000 fever points and some special packs in hopes to pack Striker Ronaldo or maybe Ibrahimovic or even Roberto Carlos, the legend. I'm, I'm really hoping Roberto Carlos because I prefer him than Ronaldo or Ibrahimovic in my opinion. So if you guys are looking for a cheap and reliable place to get your coin, check out battle.com. The link will be in the description and use the code ETANI to get 5% off. If you're looking for PSN cards, Microsoft points or cheap games, check the link also in the description. So here we go, 500 FIFA points. Let us see what we get in the very first 25k pack. And uh, wow, that was so bad. So bad. Like the rare players do it all under 80. Pretty bad that one. So let's move on. Let's hope for something better than the first pack. And we managed to get... Oh my days. For some reason I thought that left back was Ronaldo. Shit. Even though he's an inform this week. He always... Contrao always tricks me. I always think I got a Ronaldo. But... Uh, let's move on. 500 FIFA points. Three more 25k packs remaining. And we get... Oh my god. Another. Another. Oh we get Sanchez. Not bad. Not bad. I think we basically make our money back from that. Let's put him up for 150 star price. But Pepe is another player that actually tricks you. You always think that, you know, you got a Ronaldo, but you haven't. Let's discard him. He doesn't go for anything anymore. And two more packs remaining. These 25k packs haven't been that great. We only got a Sanchez out of it. And another pack that you can't really sell anyone in it. So let's move on. All these rare cards, and most of them are useless. Last 25k pack, let's hope for the best. And we managed to get... Oh man, okay, we're gonna spend, you know, I'm gonna show the highlights, but hopefully we get something good. Oh, we get Andy Carroll, <laughs> our first inform, and our 12,000 FIFA points are basically gone. Not too bad, I guess. How much does he even go for? Pretty sure the scald price because of the amount of coins. Oh, not too bad then. It's not the scald price, but from 12,000 FIFA points I expected better but let's keep him you know no point of selling him he's only gonna get me 20k or even lower than that so let's move on hopefully in our 975 FIFA points we can get something more oh my god the pack right after we get Andy Carroll again what the fuck how can I get two informs in a row and it's the same fucking inform what is the chances of that even happening? What the hell? This is the first time it's ever happened to me. Let me know in the comment section below. Is Has this ever happened to you? Where you get an inform and the pack right after that. The exact same inform. Alright guys, we are down to our final pack. Let us see what we get in this free pack. Um, let's move to my packs. Here we go. Alaba's on the front. Can we get an Ibrahimovic or Ronaldo in a free gold pack? Imagine the chance of that happening. But no, we get to Nolito at 77 overall. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, I'd really appreciate a like. I am going to be trying to open more packs just before Ronaldo's out of packs. Because I'm really trying to pack him again. Or maybe just Ibra because Ibra is still alright. Um, I'm not sure what I'm going to do. But hopefully EA release more special packs and... Uh, we get better luck than this. We got Andy Carroll twice in a row. What is the chances of that happening? I have, I have no idea. In all the years I've played Ultimate Team, it's never happened to me. So, hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, let me know what you guys got in your packs. And hope you guys have.